The GTX 460, released back in 2010 for a price of around $250, was one of the most viable options for all mid-range PC builders. But what about now, a decade later, can it still play any games? I called the higher-end 400 series cards. This one is very power-hungry, requiring two 6-pin power connectors with a TDP of 150 watts, equaling more modern GPUs like the RX 570 and GTX 1070. Featuring just 768MB of VRAM alongside a 192-bit memory bus, offering 336 CUDA cores, it doesn't even come close to today's standards, even making it somewhat obsolete. But is that really the case? Let us find out with some gaming benchmarks. As you could see, this card still has some life left in it, even getting away with 1080p in some titles like Dirt Rally 2 or CSGO. But to conclude everything you have seen, I personally would not really recommend this card anymore. 
Of course, if you have one of these, you could still play some games here and there, but don't consider buying one. It just has a very high power consumption, no driver support and very low VRAM, which will only make it more difficult in the future for playing newer and more demanding games.